Welcome to the testing word. So previously we have seen how we can trigger Chrome browser and how we can enter URL. In this session, I'll show you how we can trigger Firefox browser and enter URL. I'm just moving to RubyMine. Here I'm going to create one more script with the name Firefox and it should be a Ruby file. So I'm just selecting Ruby. So my second file is created. As we know, first we need to import water library. So I'm writing require and that is water. And we have already seen previously. First we need to create browser object. So I'm creating browser is equal to water and I'm using browser class dot new. We are creating an object of that and I'm passing Firefox. That's my symbol argument. So this time I want to start Firefox. I'm just going to execute this. Previously we have seen if we are directly trying to communicate with the browser, it's going to be failed and the error is same. We did not set Geeko driver. So previously we have seen to communicate with any browser, we need to convert our test case instructions in the language that browser can understand. And for, for doing this complete process, we are going to get a browser plugin that is provided by the browser itself. So we need to set this plugin, which behave as an interface between our script and the browser. So we need to set this, that plugin and that we have see, previously seen how we can download. So I'm just coming here. Please download this plugin from this location. So I just copy it and I'm going to download that plugin. So coming here. And the latest version is 0.18. So you can download this and it's a Windows 64. So I'm just going to download and unzip. After download, once you unzip that, we are going to get this like Geeko driver. We need to set this path in our script and we also set this path previously. So I'm just going to show how we can set this path for setting this path. We need to use Selenium libraries and previously I've shown you water web driver is a wrapper over the Selenium. So we can use Selenium libraries here as well. So I'm just going for the require Selenium web driver and for setting the path, setting the path of this driver executable, we can say setting the path of this plugin, we can use Selenium web driver firefox and then driver path and whatever the path you can pass it over here so my path is this i just copy this location and that's my file name so file name with extension and on the place of backward slash i'm using forward slash so because when we are giving the path, it's always good to use forward slash. There will not be any chance of the failure then. So I'm using forward slash. Everything is done. I'm just going to execute this script. It should trigger browser. As of now, I just write the script for the browser trigger. We did not write command for entering URL. So it should trigger browser as of now. So if you notice browser is triggered. I'm just closing it. Everything is done here. We have seen previously to enter URL. We can use method go to I'm coming here. Browser dot go to whatever the URL. So in our case, that's my URL and I'm running it again. So now it should start browser enter username enter URL. So I'm just waiting for browser to be trigger. So here browser started and it enter URL here. So here we have seen how we can trigger Firefox browser and enter URL. That's all we have for this session. Thanks for watching this video. Hi friends.
Hope you are enjoying this video. If you have any question regarding this video, you can ask your question in the comment section. Also, I would request you to please subscribe our channel. You can subscribe it by clicking on this subscribe button for getting notification about all the new videos which we are going to upload on the daily basis. Also, we are offering our all the video courses at very high discounted price. We have 50 plus video courses which can be beneficial for you in your daily job activities. If you are interested to buy any video course or all video course, you can call or WhatsApp us on this number. Also, you can be in touch with us by using Facebook, LinkedIn or Twitter. Happy learning!